We are gathered here to witness the joining in matrimony of Stephen John Park and Haley Jacqueline McAllister. And a very warm welcome to you here to Runa Farm on what we hope is going to be a very, very special and happy day for our bride and groom. Look at you. Okay, Haley. I always find it hard to put these thoughts and feelings into words. I never feel like I can do them justice. How do I explain that when I look at you, I still get lost in those eyes, like I did when I first ever saw you? Well, that your smile makes my heart smile, and every time you hold my heart, it takes me back to the first time you held it. I'll always be grateful for you coming into my life. I fell for you straight away. You showed me what love is, what it means to be a partner, to have a partner in life and a soulmate. I keep falling for you and the feelings just keep getting stronger and stronger. A younger of me wouldn't have believed this was possible in the short time that we'd been together, but it took me 37 years to find you, seconds to fall for you, and only a few months to tell you I was in love with you. Louis Bailey, and I promise I'll always be yours, always ever more, and on and on. I did never think what we had existed. I didn't think that you existed. If someone had asked me what the was before I met you, I would have said I truly didn't know it was real. I've always believed there's a soulmate for everyone. I just hadn't found mine till I found you. Don't get married. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Once upon a time you two met, you have shared much love and laughter. May your marriage be a fairy tale. Happy ever after. I am glad I'm in the fairy tale and you are too, I guess. Congratulations, King and Queen, from your fairy tale princess. I, Stephen John Paul, take the Haley Jacqueline McAllister to be my wedded wife. Give you this ring. That's a sign of our marriage. My love for you. <laughs> Promise you my friendship, my respect and my trust. It is my huge pleasure to declare that you are husband and wife together. Now I'm going to invite you to share your first kiss as husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. Welcome and thank you all for joining us today to celebrate the love and the marriage of Haley and Stephen. Haley, it was an absolute honour to walk you down the aisle today to marry the love of your life, Stephen. Haley, Stephen and Alona, you make a beautiful, solid family unit, caring for each other every day, and it's such a pleasure for all of us to share that journey with you. Very special thanks to the lady in my life, Lorna. Yeah, look at that. You were only five when your mum introduced us. And I can't believe how much you've grown since then. And I never thought I would be a dad to a human. But I feel very lucky to have you as a daughter. Haley, you look amazing. You really do. You always do, but just, wow. I remember the first day I met you, of course, and I would have bet my boots that you weren't on the list of names I had to pick up. Just, when I called your name, you stood up, I was, just, I was rightly or wrongly, I was just like, oh my. And then I got to know you, and I was just gonna need more, more of you. And it, it was really sad, because it was like you didn't know your own birth. You hadn't been treated like half as well as, as you should have been. And I thought, if I could just make you see that, and see that smile a bit more and more and that's that's all I want and if anything comes of it great and if not as long as you're a bit happier then that's that's great obviously something has come of it I don't think I could thank you enough for everything you've done and do on a daily basis the love you show support and understanding just everything in general it's just amazing and it, it has it's always amazed me how natural everything's felt 
raise a glass to my beautiful wife and my family, new and old, please. Cheers. First, the bride. Thank you for always taking care of me and if something's wrong, you would always look after me. Thank you for all the chats and the help and the care. I'd like to especially thank my gorgeous daughter who is the light of my life. She makes myself and Stephen so proud. You are the most beautiful flower girl and amazing daughter in the world and you're so kind and so thoughtful and I love you very, very much. Most of all, I'd like to thank my new husband for asking me to be his. For turning up four years ago and showing me what true love really is. You came into my life and completely changed it for the better. From the moment I first saw you in the reception in the Rev. I knew you were special. I did also have a small panic, panic trying to calculate how I would stalk you and find you um, if you weren't picking me up. Um, and that obviously took a lot of calculation, but thankfully you were. We've never really parted since then. We've made it through every obstacle thrown at us. You've seen me at my worst. You've been through a surrogacy with me. You've been through surgery with me and you've been a pillar of support. I adore you. You are most, my soulmate, my biggest supporter, the best man I could have ever chosen to be a stepdad to Alana and you're the only person I've given my soul to. I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you, Mr. Park. All that you are is all that I will ever need. Marriage requires devotion, the ability to listen, sometimes the wisdom to know when we are wrong, and then the courage to put things right. Marriage enables two people to share their strengths and their weaknesses, their hopes and their fears, their desires and aspirations. <laughs>